purposes for it to drag it. It's a uh, casual uh, role playing game. So, uh, the way it works is you choose to go on adventures. See, I did a tutorial level. And we can pick at random, or we can choose from a gallery. Let's pick a random one. Medium difficulty. And this is where I try and remember what the instructions are. Ooh. Right, so, you can swing with the sword. Uh, you can talk to the man, I'm not far enough away from him. Swing with the sword again. <coughs> you got a massive swing with the sword. Uh, here's the rest of the controls. Little bit if you can that. And we have an inventory system. various puzzles to be dealt with. I know I think I just just guess right solving that first one. Yeah. Maybe I have to find other barrels. Right. Huh? Defeated them. Let's find this archer. Stick control, which generally I'm pretty bad with. So, not. Oh, no problem either. Let's see what that does then. Oh, so that gets me around to the start again. Let's pick up the barrel. So, yes. As, uh, as I'm sort of demonstrating, there are puzzle elements to the dungeons. Now, what I'm assuming at this point is that there's one I can put that on. There we go. It'll do that. I'm going to go restore my health. So you see that's now got 133 left because I restored 17 health. Oh, something with 109 hit points over there. Oh. Lost one health. Let's go and claim it back. So 
So, is there another barrel in here that I can access? No, but there's a chest. Uh, and I've got a potion. As I understand it, these these maps are um, user user generated. <laughs> oh, user contributed. I currently had. Let's have a look. Gloves of Doubt, 11 Protect. Rugged Braces, 2 Protect. No. So. Sword, shield of uncertainty. So this is basically the thing. You go around. You beat up stuff that's in the dungeons. Ooh, club of averageness. Various loot has a. Uh, different rarity values and that sort of thing. Interesting. So, about more can't get through that. I'll pull this lever. Get another barrel out. So, now can I actually get out with the barrel? Is the next question. Because they're both closed. I don't know. <laughs> oh, yeah, more puzzling stuff. Let's go and leave that over here. Because you never know. I might want it again. Then I can get out this way, can I? At least I can go and recharge my health. Alright. Now the jumping is automatic, should we? Ah, 
I'm dead. On the other hand, I did kill one of the things, or he died at least. He died at least, because he's still in the lava too. Obviously, is get away from that ledge. <laughs> and quick, right. <laughs> Mash some buttons. There we go. Shield of fragility. I'm guessing not much use to me. Average gloves, a bit of gold. So now I have another barrel. Now, has that opened up anything back here? Could I? So I can take that through there. I can put that on there. And I can go around this back way. That's I discovered. Yes, if that's the thing to do. Switch was. Anyone else remember? Wasn't that way? Wasn't this way? Where was it? I can't climb when I'm holding the thing. This is quite a cunning a cunning level, isn't it? Through here somewhere. Let's pull that down and kill all these rats. Drink the health potion. I'm pressing up. There we go. Uh, more gloves. Another shield. More money. Pick up the health potion again. So. I'm looking for a switch. Is it possible I just need to put it on a different one at the start there? That is possible, isn't it? So, this video is dragging on a bit because I've randomly selected a... Um, I randomly selected a uh, client. Quite awkward looking level. Did that open the door? I think that was the right one, yes. Now we have to go back round. Not that way, this way. Yes. 
so some of these dungeons they take take a lot less time than this this seems to be a bit more involved than you know average dungeon so I'm guessing if we get this one in the right place then we'll get through to the boss and it'll all be over and then I can show you some of the other things in the game uh, yeah so like I said That opened it? Yes. Like I said, they, they, some of them are more the uh, 10 minute variety. This one's, well, we're getting on for 15 minutes. But it's still a, a you know, a sort of casual, casual level. This one's about to go in it. Let's go and have a crack at the saucer again. <laughs> They're all chasing me. Stay on one health. Ugh. Uh, as you may have noticed, I'm not that great at directing twin strict shooters. <gasps> Oh 
more dead. I think we're all dead. Let's loot everything. Oh, there's one over there, look. There we go. So that was it. I've completed the dungeon. I'll drink a health potion. Got a clear fragility. Exit adventure. Yes, I'm sure. I've earned a dragon scroll. I think that was actually quite a difficult mission. So, I'm back at my... Um, back at my base, so I can go to the loot shrine. And I can sell all my crap. Uh, let's just check. Sword, 70% damage, 27.2, 11, 8, 14, 27, 4, 6, 6, 15, that's 27, 19, 5. So I don't think anything I picked up is actually better than what I'm currently going to quit. I'm going to donate it all to the Loot Shrine. I'm pressing X. X, 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 X. So, current donation 277. 120 for the next tier. So, when I donate to the Loot Shrine, I'm only in bronze tier at the minute. So I need another 120 to get into silver tier, so we'll just go for it with bronze and see what we get. No, I can't get anything. Basically, when you when you uh, donate enough stuff, you, you get uh, legendary things out, or you know, extraordinary. That's how I got these boots, which give me bonuses. I'm not got enough money though, so we'll go and do the other thing. The reason why the game is called Fight the Dragon is because you saw at the end of that adventure, I won a dragon scroll, which means I get a shot at the dragon. Um, it's going to be a hopeless shot at the dragon, I can tell you now. See, I've killed it down 225 out of a million hit points. Um, nothing is really active. So, what I'm going to do is charge. Charge. I've got a spare life left though. Let's go for it. I've done 64 points of damage. I'm running away. I'm running away. No spare life left. How did I do? 104 points of damage. So the objective is eventually to uh, kill the dragon. How long that'll take? Huh? Huh? 
Ah, got me to the wing. 201. So I have a ticket remaining. I survived a minute. I've got it down to, uh, you know, almost, almost less than, <laughs> almost less than 999,500. So I'm going to exit to menu. So that's the game. It is, it is quite fun, I think. Yeah, this is the create, create levels. Customize your character. Online multiplayer, which we've not tried yet. And the heroes register. But yes, I've, I've been having great fun with it. It's obviously quite a simple game. Um, allows for casual play but also you know RPG mechanics generally quite fun uh, definitely worth getting watch out for it in the uh, Steam sale this week uh, I recommend you buy it <laughs>